Hi friends, thought of sharing a few lockdown creativity with you. Yes, after many many years, I got a chance to do something creative, DIY, do it yourself. And during lockdown, there were no shops open, no materials available. So I just went through, just went around hunting for things, and then I got these old worn out clothes. I made strips of these old clothes. I braided them as we braid the hair, just rolled them up like that of a chakli, glued them up, used needle and thread and a little color combination, creativity and lo, it turned out to be beautiful floor mat with a great utility value. Yes, it looked beautiful on the floor and I got a great satisfaction for doing this DIY after several years. My second item is a cute mobile holder. Well, this was originally a chocolate box as you can see. I didn't want to throw it away. So I used an old shoelace to hang it and lo, it turned out to a beautiful, useful mobile holder. At night, we could easily charge it as well as place our mobile in this holder. Isn't it a cute one? Even I loved it. The third one, well, it is a, it is a mouse pad and it, the mouse pad was worn out and my husband was complaining like I want a new one. But the shops were closed. What to do? I just took a few card papers, two to three layers, cut them in the shape of this mouse pad, stuck them below, cleaned the top portion and I used a white ink to decorate it. And lo, it turned out to be a beautiful new mouse pad. <laughs> well, I'm sure the employees at Apple also wouldn't have this beautiful mouse pad as my husband has. And I think mouse pads can be decorative and fancy too. Don't you think so? So thus, this is my third DIY during the lockdown period. Where there is a will, there is a way. And then again, I went around hunting for something to make and I got the A4 sized paper. I used the A4 sized plain papers. I cut them into circles, just cut a few petals around its edges and it turned out to be good daisies. I used a sketch pen to color in the center. Then I used the broomstick, covered it with some old green crepe paper that I had. I cut a few leaves from the crepe paper and I stuck it here and there. Then I stuck the daisies in a row on the broomstick and lo, it turned out to be a beautiful row of daisies. I used these daisies in many of my videos which I had made for the kindergarten students, the nursery and junior kg students and it really looked beautiful in those videos. Very simple to make. I'm going to make it make them again. So this is for today. Bye.